Bluebeard. I was bobbing light as a lilo on the froth of the evening when I sensed his being a furrow. Intense and irrefutable, singeing hemlines and eyelashes as it swept the room. In an instant, the babble became backdrop. Colours receded as I was gathered by the current and swept off into a different town. Dark conduits, his eyes, stone walled. He'd laid out his conversation like a labyrinth. Tunnels that narrowed and curved, full of soft, murky words. Soon, I could travel no more. An inflatable doll, floating amongst the spume and debris, slowly losing 